I don't know enough about it. I do know I wish I would have invested in it. So I just stopped at the, uh, the used stop there to pick up some water. I realized we started filming today and I didn't even bring any H2O with me. Anyway, so I was at the used stop and half of the uh, methodology was to get some change back. And I only got dollar bills back, so hopefully one of these got a good serial number and we can make Nicholas proud. For the star note. Got L0669759 star. 6287A, 654650D, nothing. What we do have is episode eight of What the Bitcoin. Nice to meet you this morning, T. What's up, man? Hey, appreciate the uh, challenger, man. I, I appreciate a clean dodge. Thank you, appreciate it. Hey, T, what are your thoughts on Bitcoin, man? Shit, I got some money invested in it, so. Really? Yeah, I invested like two or three years ago. 2017? Yeah. Man, heck yeah, so you've been, you've been holding on to it? Yeah. Do you trade it all? No, I just hold it. Hold long term. Hold long term. Right? Okay. I can use it, you know, for my son, college fund, something like that one of these days. Yeah. For long term. Awesome. And what's your son's name? Messiah. Messiah. Hey, congrats on the son, man, and, and taking care of the family. I appreciate that, T. Yeah. And then moving forward, what do you think the, the future of Bitcoin looks like? Honestly, I think it's going to pay off in the long run, holding it, staying strong, and see good dividends from it in the, in the near future. Okay, and then this last question, a little outlandish, I just like to, you know, any chance that Bitcoin's God? That it's God? Yeah. No, 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 okay. no. I don't believe in that crazy like that. Yeah, I, I appreciate like it. good investment. So. Yeah, well, T, thank you so much for your time this morning. Yeah, hey, I appreciate that, man. Hi. 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 Sweet baby. What are you guys' names? Alicia. Alicia and? Callie. Alicia, what do you think about Bitcoin? Um, I, I, I really don't have an opinion on it, really. Okay. Not my cup of tea. Not your cup of tea. Yeah, but um, I mean, somebody out there for it. Hey, Callie, uh, what do you think about Bitcoin? Um, well, I mean, I'm like she is. I really don't know a lot about it. Okay. But like, what I do know about it, I don't know. I just, it's weird because it's all online, so you don't get to it personally, and then you get locked out of your account so easily, and you can't get it back, yeah. so that kind of scares me on it. But yeah. yeah. Other than that, I don't really have a big opinion on it. Okay. Because I don't know a lot about it. Yeah, and then to make it more of an opinion, would you guys consider it more of a scam, or more of a good thing for for the uh, future? I wouldn't say scam, I, I don't... And folks, we're at the part of the video now where I'd really like to uh, ask you to like, comment, and subscribe. Come on, man, so I can get back to work. I don't say scam. I, I don't. I just think it has a lot of kinks to work out. A lot of kinks. Yeah, I can worked see out that. I can see it being thing. beneficial. Mm -hmm. um, just again, not something that. That's really odd. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. that's super mindful I, for you. Uh -huh. Okay, and then when's the last time you guys heard about Bitcoin prior to me bringing it up today? Yeah, it's been so long. Years, months, yeah. weeks? Months for me. Months, so like the beginning of the year? Yes. Maybe around GameStop time? Um, yeah. More, yeah, because yeah. my father-in-law was looking into it. And about the same, same for you. Okay, and then real crazy outlandish question, any chance that Bitcoin's God, guys? No. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yes, please, <laughs> feel free. Hey, yo, Bitcoin man. Aaron, nice to meet you. How was your Monday? It was a Monday, but it's almost over. Week to a good start? Yes. Okay, very good. What are your thoughts on Bitcoin? I don't know enough about it. I do know I wish I would have invested in it a long time ago because I hear about people who might have gotten it for like the single digits, like five shares or whatever. I don't even know how you- No, I, I think the current trading, and don't hold me to this, is about fifty-five to $56,000 a coin. Right. I didn't even know how they qualified it. Yeah. Okay. Well, they just, I, I guess you could call it a, a bottle of water. The coin, you can get percentages of it. You don't have to own a whole. Got it. Very limited in my knowledge. Very limited. Do you know anyone that owns it by chance? Yeah. Wow. And then when's the last time you heard of Bitcoin prior to me bringing it up with you today? I think it was during the whole, the GameStop. Okay. Stuff in the news. So and we were talking about Bitcoin. And I think it was just because, I don't know, like there was just some correlation between the two. Yeah. I'm not quite sure what it was, but that was okay. the last time I heard about it. 
Very good. And this was like so a couple like a few months ago. Yeah. Then yeah. and then uh, this last question is a bit outlandish. Uh -huh. But Aaron, do you think there's any chance that Bitcoin is is God or, or spiritual in any way? Well, I think you could ask the same question about any currency. I'm sure there are some people who believe that it is. Personally, I don't. Okay. You know, it's like a form of trade almost. Okay. And then any closing remarks in, in currency, investments, anything in general uh, for what you would say is a philosophy? Like I worked in the financial industry for years. I was in venture capital. I'm, I'm excited to see these new forms coming. Like, it's obviously evolving. I think there's something to it. And like I said, I wish I had known more about it and been smart enough to invest. Of course. But with these things, I kind of like to wait how they play out. And it's like, I'm, I'm a little risk averse. So. Yeah, but that's the key to trading, right? I is so. Hey, that was episode eight of What the... But before we go ahead and close out this episode, I would like to get some channel updates for you folks. Today, we uh, upgraded the RAM on the PC. Look at the... We had to move the desk to get back there. And actually, just now, when I was standing this desk up to film my exit, where we're usually like right around here or something, guys, Right? My HDMI, my display port, pardon me, for my curved monitor there was lodged behind the table. And when I hit my standing desk feature to stand up, my PC just started lifting and I was all the way over there, not a chance in heck. And then it got loose and the PC crashed down literally the day that we upgraded it. And I don't really feel like bending back over there, but thankfully we have two display ports because one of those two is now trashed. Subscribe here during the highlights, please. Watch my most recent content here. Like, comment below. Blue. Any chance that Bitcoin's God? That it's God? Yeah. No, no, no. Oh. no. I'll leave you that like that. Yeah, I, I appreciate it. Yeah. Then, and then uh, this last question is a bit outlandish, but Aaron, do you think there's any chance that Bitcoin is, is God or, or spiritual in any way? I think you can ask the same question about any currency. I'm sure there are some people who believe that it is. Personally, I don't. Is there any chance that Bitcoin's God, guys? Yeah. Yes, please, feel free.